Colorado River Authority is providing $200,000 to help people in the Hill Country clean up after this recent flood. Lano and Burnett counties will get $100,000 each. County judges will decide the best ways to use that money, which will include removing debris from rivers and lakes. Homeowners in Lago Vista have a long road ahead to try to get back to normal. They've been out of their homes for days, and a lot of their belongings are gone. The American Red Cross set up shop there today to provide supplies and support. KXAN's Eugene Show witnessed the community coming together to bounce back from destruction. It's just devastating. You know, I had three and a half feet of water in my home. Gloria was told she had 24 hours to move what she could to higher ground and leave. Before uh, the, fl the, the flood waters receded and I saw it at its peak, I was literally just shaking, you know. This is what she came back home to last week. Where the green grass of that backyard and debris meet, that line marks just how far the flood water came in. Gloria's house is more than 100 feet down this driveway. The backyard was completely underwater. From where we're standing now, it was probably uh, up high to our waist. She's been working nonstop for five days, removing drywall and damaged items from her garage. She came to pick up tarp and work gloves from Casa Mexico, a local coffee shop that became a makeshift donation and support headquarters. I mean, we was full of water, chlorine, gloves, masks, and everything has been gone, so the people keep bringing stuff. Red Cross also stationed volunteers there Monday, guiding people through the recovery process. Oh, yeah. People are strong. Taking it one day at a time. The main thing is I'm, I'm alive, my children are healthy, my grandchildren are fine, and this is just stuff. It's a lot of work. And one day it's going to be okay. It's going <laughs> to okay. be beautiful again one day. One day. <laughs> In Lago Vista, Eugene Show, KXAN News. Casa Mexico's owner told us she doesn't know for how much longer she'll accept donations at her shop, but she doesn't mind using the space to help the community. The Red Cross will be in Lakeway tomorrow to help people with recovery efforts. They'll give out emergency supplies and offer crisis counseling. That's happening from 11 a.m. to 7 p.m. at the Lake Travis Community Library. In Hill Country, the multi-agency resource center is offering help to flood victims. They'll be in Granite Shoals on Wednesday at the First Baptist Church. And they'll be at the Boys and Girls Club of Marble Falls on Thursday. Both locations are open from 10 a.m. to 7 p.m.